Biotech, I think, is an interesting one. I think biotech first labels an industry uh, which is start-up, so as opposed to large pharma. Um, so very dedicated, very focused, young companies focusing on one substance um, and, 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 and running a big bet of bringing that to the market. But there's another industry within biotech which we feel is probably, you know, for us as advisors is probably sometimes more interesting because it's more entrepreneurial and more mid-cap. And those are the enablers. So there's a lot of biotech companies who offer a certain technology, an IT-based bio-IT library of antibodies, for example, which they offer or rent out to large pharma. So some of them do have certain technologies which they then offer as a, as a service provider to, to, to developing companies or they're themselves um, contract developers, um, where they, they offer certain certain capacity, certain technologies to, to their pharma clients. And, and they have different business models. They, they really normally have business model of being a service provider. And, and then they don't need to wait for 13 years before the new drug is approved and they can bring it to the market. So they're, they're, they have different business models. And, and, and this service provider biotech types, they are pretty vibrant. Um, they are sometimes, some of them are, are, are quickly growing, uh, um, scaling. Um, and, and currently there's, there's also great, great interest um, in, 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 in doing m and in, in that sector, um, founding larger platforms. There's a lot of private equity money looking for, for good performance in that, in that um, CDMO, CRO sector.